Here's Frank Zappa's solo on Cosmic Debris. All right, Frank Zappa solo in Cosmic Debris. It's a 12 bar blues in C minor pentatonic. Or in the uh, first position. And that's where the solo starts. Let's look at measure one. Those first four beats start with a classic blues bend. I got my third finger on the third fret of the G string, bending up to the first finger on the first fret of the B string. Fourth beat, I bend the same note up. And now I'm hitting the fourth fret of the B string, which is E flat, which is the minor third above C as this is in C minor pentatonic. Measure two. Measure two starts where measure one left off with that E flat. And the second uh, note is a pinch harmonic on the third uh, string, third fret. Pinch harmonics are played with a pick and immediately dampened with the meat of your thumb so that all the lower harmonics are uh, filtered out, leaving you with a high squeal. So second measure. A lot of bending on that third fret. Let's do second measure slowly. Last three notes are pull-offs to that open G. Measure three. Measure three begins with a bend up to the, the same bend as before, up to the, um, the E flat. But you're gonna keep that G string bent up and you're gonna sort of reverse rake your pick from the B down to the G string again. Slower. All right, measure four. I'm gonna play the last three notes of measure three to lead into that phrase. All right, let's look at measure four slower. That's the G and the B string on the first fret. Measure five, you got a tortured F there. So you kind of, you're on the D string, third fret. Frank doesn't do the typical sort of vibrato on this blues solo. He likes to really torture this, the notes, pull them in and out of tune and kind of yank them around like a, like a mad dog on a leash.
All right, measure five slowly. Measure six. Measure six slower. Measure six one more time. Measure seven. One more time, measure seven. And one last time. Measure eight begins with a pre-bent G string on the 10th fret. So you're going to bend that G string up, release it, and then bend it back up, and then do this kind of reversed, reverse rake uh, gesture. So I'm reverse plucking quickly from the G string to the D string and then pulling off. second half of that phrase is right. so the last two notes of measure eight um, are the beginning of a phrase that continues in measure nine all right so we're on the fourth fret and the sixth fret, with a little bend on that second note, with a slide down to that F. And measure 10. That last note is the downbeat of measure 11. Measure 11 continues, starting on the second beat here. So we got a bend, 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 straight, straight. So you're bending up, and you get these two little, and then the same note twice without the bend. All right, let's play the whole solo real slow. All right, Frank Zappa's guitar solo off Cosmic Debris. That tune is on the Apostrophe record. Great record. Go out and get it. If you like Zappa's music, you might like my band, Dr. Nerve. Check us out on MySpace and YouTube. See you there. You can tell. The Russian guy can tell. Koski, come here. <laughs>
All right, just touch him any place you like and tell the audience whether or not he's a schmuck. He won't hurt you. This guy's a schmuck. Yeah. Ah! Thank you, Mr. Koski.